Yo, welcome to Big Wayne's World. Party time, excellent. Woo, 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 woo. Want to talk to you today about uh, anxiety. Being depressed, man, you know, uh, that's, that's a hard issue to deal with because we all go through phases in life. We all go through periods of life when uh, we're up and we all go through periods of time when we're down. And the more we say we ain't this and that or whatever, let's just put more pressure on us. So, uh, there are ways to deal with it. And that's what I want to talk to you about. It's just dealing with depression and anxiety. Because I've dealt with it. I've went through a lot of places of times in my, my life. And periods uh, uh, of depression and anxiety. And I went through these stages and felt like I didn't have nobody to talk to. I didn't know what to do. So, I just sat there and I loathed and was morose and sad or whatever and I felt bad for, for no reason but there's, there's, there's no reason to do it you got to get up and, and get going and don't don't sit there and wallow in that uh, in that depressing stage so I just want to give you a couple couple of tricks to you know what I'm saying uh, to change that outcome and uh, change that outlook because you don't have to be in that forever you don't have to feel like there is no uh, cure or there's no escape from anxiety or depression uh, I'm going to tell you the, the, the best thing that I found to, to help me out with this uh, issue was first you got to exercise 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 there's nothing like getting up and, and, and getting that blood first of all flowing through your body to me that's like, that's like moving all the bad toxins in your blood and, and moving it around and getting that chemistry, whatever you want to call it, the chemistry, the science, whatever, getting that shit going so you can feel better, first of all, because when you feel better, you're going to do better. And you, when you think better, I mean, that's, that's, that's pretty much the bottom base line of depression. It's how you think. The second thing I'm going to say is do some meditating. Whether you find that through praying, praying to God, Praying to whoever you pray to. Focus on yourself. Just sitting in a, in a quiet room. I like to call this going to a silent space. Going to a silent space where you can just focus on you. And I'm talking about where you go somewhere so silent that you can hear your own heartbeat. Right? And focus on every fiber that's in you. Focus on yourself. Focus on what's triggering you. And what's making you feel the way you do. Focus on yourself when you go to this silent space. And when you do that, you clear your mind of all the things that are, that are toxic to you. You clear all that toxic thinking. You get it out of your head. Three, I would say, just make some plans or write down what you need to do. Make an itinerary of what you need to do. I, I like to use task manager, basically to keep me in line. Basically to say, this is what you're gonna do. So I don't have an excuse to say, I forgot, I didn't know, because a lot of times you know you got things to do and you're too depressed or you're feeling anxiety and so you force yourself not to do it. This way you say, I've already committed to it, I need to get these things done. I need to talk to this person, call this person, whether it's about a bill. It's crazy how people may have anxiety about talking about bills. I do, because I don't like to hear how broke I am. But... It needs to be done. These are things that need to be done. So when you commit to it, when you make plans, when you make an itinerary, when you put it in the task manager and say, these are my plans for the week. This is how my week's going to go. My time's already committed to these things. And so therefore, they must be done. Another thing I'd say do is watch some TV. Not too much TV. Or let me reframe that. Watch your favorite TV. Because a lot of times, I say with me, like, you know, I'm a father, I'm a family man. A lot of times I put things on to entertain other people. Watch what you want to watch. Period. No cartoons. I mean, if you like cartoons, watch cartoons. I like Seinfeld. I like, I'm going to watch Seinfeld because Seinfeld makes me laugh. And that's where I get my enjoyment from. Beyond that, I watch sports or whatever, but I watch what I want to watch to make me feel happy. Very important one. Eat healthy or healthier. You don't have to be vegetarian or vegan, but you do have to make some changes to your diet because a lot of that crap that you put into yourself, you're going to feel it. I can feel it even on the just most minute scale 
of the things that I'm, you know, the, when I put something bad into my body, I feel it. When I put something good into my body, I can feel it. There is a difference. There's a difference on the way it has. It, it, it impacts your body, not just by being fat or making you beautiful. It's by how you feel. And like you said, if you feel good, you think good. And so why not? Eat healthy. Count your calories. Be conscious of what you are putting into your system. An important one is propaganda news. Avoid the news. You know, the, the news is very rarely something that's good on the news. It's very depressing. I get sick of looking at Donald Trump. I get hit. I get sick and tired of hearing Donald Trump. It's negative. Don't don't watch the news because the news is negative. Cops killing black folks. Cops killing this person. This person killed this person. Somebody got robbed. This that you know. It's so negative. Fear tactics, anxiety, in, in in enablers. Stay away from negative news. And last but not least, smile more, cause you're beautiful. And if you don't believe it, nobody else will. If you don't believe you're smart, nobody else will. And if you don't respect yourself, nobody else will. It ain't nobody else's fault but yours. And so that's it. That's it for the day for Big Wayne's World. I hope you take these uh, considerations uh, serious. And I hope it impacts you. And I hope it makes your day better, your week better, your year better, your whole life better. And hang with me. Because I got some more stuff to tell you. For reals. Wayne's World. Wayne's World. Party time. Excellent. Woo-hoo-hoo.